The Galaxy S26 Ultra is widely expected to support 60-watt wired charging, powered by Samsung's new super-fast charging 3 technology. If the rumors hold, it will mark the company's first major charging upgrade in years. A new Samsung charger was silently listed on the company's website. It is called the 60-watt power adapter and carries the model number EPT6010. It has a single universal serial bus Type-C port that offers a maximum power output of 60 watts and can go as low as 5 milliwatts to save power when it is not actively used. A new report from WinFuture has revealed additional early details about the Galaxy S26 series and its accessories. According to their exclusive coverage, Samsung is now preparing to launch the Galaxy S26, Galaxy S26 Plus, and Galaxy S26 Ultra, and a wide range of official accessories is already in development. This confirms Samsung's plan to make magnetic wireless charging a standard feature across the entire Galaxy S26 lineup. According to the latest information shared by the German publication, Samsung is preparing several official accessories for the Galaxy S26 lineup. These include Samsung Magnetic Carbon Case in Black for the Galaxy S26 and Galaxy S26 Plus, Samsung Clear Case Transparent for the Galaxy S26, Galaxy S26 Plus, and Galaxy S26 Ultra, Samsung Magnetic Clear Case transparent for the Galaxy S26, Galaxy S26 Plus, and Galaxy S26 Ultra. Samsung Dual Magnet Holder Ring for all Galaxy S26 models. Samsung Magnetic Rugged Clear Case for the Galaxy S26, Galaxy S26 Plus, and Galaxy S26 Ultra. Samsung Magnetic Silicone Case for the Galaxy S26, Galaxy S26 Plus, and Galaxy S26 Ultra, available in black or gray. The Samsung Galaxy S26 Ultra smartphone models with the model numbers SMS948BS-DS, SMS948B, SMS948U, and SMS948U1 have appeared on the Federal Communications Commission Certification Database. The letter B represents the India or International variant, while U refers to the United States variant. These devices receive approval under the Federal Communications Commission identification number A3 LSMS 948B and A3 LSMS 948U. In the certification listing, the smartphone is described as a portable handset, and several connectivity features have been confirmed, including support for second generation, third generation, fourth generation, and fifth generation networks, triple band wireless fidelity 72, 4 gigahertz, 5 gigahertz, and 6 gigahertz, Bluetooth basic rate, enhanced data rate, low energy, near field communication, wireless power transfer for wireless reverse charging, and ultra wideband. Additionally, the listing confirms the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Elite Generation 5 chipset model SM8850 for the device along with Qualcomm Smart Transmit Plus Extended Feature Set version 24, which supports antenna grouping and a multi-transmit factor of 1.27. A schematic diagram showing the layout of different antennas. Wireless Fidelity 1 is 2.4 GHz slash 5 GHz slash 6 GHz. Wireless Fidelity 2 is 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz slash 6 GHz. And Ultra Wideband 1 and Ultra Wideband 2 receive only has also been included. It looks like Samsung's own leaked software may include images of the upcoming flagship models. Images resembling official renders of the Galaxy S26 lineup were discovered inside One UI 8.5. One of these, identified by Android Authority, shows a device using the codenames M1 and M2, while another image highlights a phone labeled with the codename M3. According to Android Authority, their examination of Samsung's One UI 8.5 software revealed a pair of renders representing the Galaxy S26 series. The first image includes a device tag with the codenames M1 and M2, and the second features a device labeled M3. Earlier leaks indicate that M1 and M2 correspond to the standard Galaxy S26 and the Galaxy S26 Plus. Meanwhile, the M3 codename has consistently been associated with the Galaxy S26 Ultra. Both newly found renders align closely with previous leaks. The two base models are expected to feature a vertical camera setup with three rear lenses, while the S26 Ultra will include the same vertical layout, but with two additional sensors positioned beside it. Along with that, we also have a set of new details that highlight what Samsung is preparing for its 2026 flagship lineup. Samsung has now released the first official teaser for the Exynos 2600 chip, and honestly, it looks impressive. The trailer highlights a refined core design, optimized performance at every level, and then reveals the confirmed name the Exynos 2600. For anyone unaware, the Exynos 2600 will be the first phone chipset built on a 2 nanometer architecture. Based on the early leaked benchmarks, the results so far look very promising. Samsung didn't include any launch dates in the trailer, 
so this serves purely as the first formal announcement of the Exynos 2600. We can expect more promotional teasers like this in the coming weeks. Speaking of official material, these could be the confirmed wallpapers for the Galaxy S26 Ultra. What makes them interesting is that they may also hint at the final color options of the S26 Ultra. Out of all the shades shown, the standout for me is definitely the new purple variant. Based on the wallpaper, it looks distinct and could be Samsung's direct response to the orange finish on the iPhone 17 Pro Max. And now, Ice Universe has shared something that quietly confirms in major detail about the color options and it's big. So here's what happened. Ice Universe posted a simple but very powerful tweet. He said, I would buy a white or silver S26 Ultra, and I would have to buy a purple S26 Ultra. And this might look like just a personal opinion, but it actually reveals something important. This statement strongly suggests that the Samsung Galaxy S26 Ultra will come in three confirmed colors, white, silver, and purple. Ice Universe almost never talks about colors unless he is sure. His pattern has always been the same if he tweets about a color, it's because he has already seen internal details. So yes, this tweet practically confirms that Samsung is preparing at least these three official color options for the S26 Ultra. White clean, classic, and premium. Silver, elegant, and futuristic. Purple, the standout color Samsung loves to push as the main highlight. And if a top insider is already talking about these options, that means Samsung's color decision is locked in. The S26 Ultra is coming closer, and leaks like this make the hype even stronger. And now Ice Universe has dropped another powerful tweet directly addressing the chaos around the S26 Ultra leaks. According to him, the tech community is flooded with too many different versions of leaks this year, and most of them don't match reality. He says he has always stood firmly by three major specifications, a 5,000 mAh battery, 60 watt charging, and a 3 times 10 megapixel telephoto camera with a 1 over 3 94 inch sensor. And he insists that these specifications are absolutely correct. Ice Universe makes it clear that time will reveal who was right. He also says he's not expecting anyone to award him a trophy when his information turns out to be accurate. What he truly hopes for is something else that the people who deliberately lie, create fake renders, and invent false specifications will delete their accounts and leave the tech leak community altogether. He says this space has been polluted to the point of becoming unbearable and outright disgusting. This tweet shows a different kind of confidence, not just in the Galaxy S26 Ultra, but in the accuracy of the information he has been sharing all year. And if his specs are correct, then the S26 Ultra is shaping up to be a balanced, refined, and intelligently upgraded device focused on keeping what works and improving what matters. And now, one of the biggest improvements might finally be confirmed. After years of slow charging speeds, Samsung is preparing to make a major jump that fans have been demanding for a long time. Multiple new reports suggest that Samsung is finally planning to upgrade the charging speeds on its upcoming flagship, the Samsung Galaxy S26 Ultra. Although we still have a couple of months before its official announcement, fresh leaks have revealed more details about this much-awaited charging boost. Recently, one UI 8.5 firmware file started circulating online, and tech enthusiasts have been digging into them. According to findings from Android Authority, several text strings inside these files mention Super Fast Charging 3. While the exact charging power isn't directly listed, this label likely refers to the previously leaked 60 watt fast charging upgrade. It appears Samsung is finally considering moving beyond the long-standing 5000 mAh battery limit that its Galaxy flagships have used for multiple generations. A new leak now suggests that the Galaxy S26 Ultra may feature the largest battery seen in a mainstream Samsung device in years. According to Momentary Digital on Weibo, the S26 Ultra will continue Samsung's recent trend of being slimmer and lighter than previous models, while also receiving a long-awaited battery increase. Reports indicate that the Galaxy S26 Ultra may come with a 5,200 mAh battery instead of the usual 5,000 mAh capacity Samsung has relied on for so long. But the S26 Ultra is beginning to look like the device that completely reshapes how we define a flagship. Let's wait and see what the Galaxy S26 Ultra truly delivers when it officially launches. Thank you so much for joining me in this video. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video. Peace out.